In Montenegro, a small group of LGBT people held the first ever gay pride march in the country's capital, Podgorica, despite being outnumbered 10 to 1 by violent anti gay extremists. Some 2,000 police officers guarded the group of 150 marchers as they braved an anti gay mob that hurled firebombs and rocks. An organizer said, quote, As of today, gay people are no longer invisible in Montenegro. Meanwhile, same-sex couples in New Jersey have begun exchanging wedding vows for the first time. On Friday, New Jersey's Supreme Court rejected a request by Republican Governor Chris Christie to halt the marriages pending an appeal. The weddings began just after midnight. Newark Mayor Cory Booker, who was recently elected to the U.S. Senate, officiated some of the state's first ceremonies at Newark City Hall. South Brunswick resident Marcia Shapiro explained why she and her wife wanted to be among the first. We've been wanting to get married for a long time. We've been together over 24 years. We were religiously married over 21 years ago. We have four children, one grandchild, and another one on the way. It's time that we get married. Last week, an official in western North Carolina accepted 10 marriage license applications from same-sex couples, despite a North Carolina state constitutional amendment banning same-sex marriage. Buncombe County Register of Deeds Drew Reisinger said he would ask North Carolina's attorney general to allow the marriages. He's the first deeds registrar in the South to accept same-sex marriage licenses.